Hi everyone and thanks once again for tuning in to Smash Factor TV. My name's Natalie Adams. Today we're going to have a look at helping you get rid of that slice or that big uh, shot to the left once and for all. So the way we're going to do that, first of all we need to look at what's causing it. If I just place my golf club on the target line here, what's happening as you come in to, to hit this ball, the club head it's hitting the ball and then it's cutting too much onto the inside of the target line. So the club head's moving too much in towards this basket. So that's the reason that I've put the range basket upside down and I've put an alignment pole through it there, is if you want to straighten that shot up, basically you need to hit the ball and then swing in front of that basket rather than cutting into it. So I've got that uh, range basket, if this is the target line here, I've got that range basket a good foot and a half just towards the target, so on the left of the ball as I set up, and also I've got it about uh, four inches inside where the target line would be. So the good, play, good way to know if you've got the ball set up correctly there, if you put the club head just on the left of the ball, and then just let the club head follow the target line down. You see that club can get past that basket there, but there isn't a great deal of room. There's only maybe an inch between the top of the basket and the shaft there. So get that basket into position. If we take the ball out first of all, just get used to, from your posture, get used to swinging the club back and just swinging the club through and just make small swings, making sure you don't hit that basket. Once you've got used to that, make a bigger swing. But same thing again, you're not hitting the basket. So you want to t work on from the top, turn your body towards the target, but make sure you let the arms release out towards the target rather than pulling the arms inwards and then the club would hit that basket. So let's have a go at hitting a shot there. So we've got the ball back in position there. So the main aim with this drill is to make sure that you hit the ball but you don't hit the basket. So as you swing through, haven't hit the basket as I've gone through, good contact with the ball. Now have a look at your ball flight. So if the ball has gone over to the right too much, you know that that's because the club face, as you've gone through uh, with that shot, you haven't pulled the club into the left, the club's traveling through, much more along the target line, but the club face has turned over to the right too much. So try uh, to make sure you keep the club face at the target as you go through with this drill. If the ball's gone too much to the left, again, you know you haven't hit the basket, so as you've swung through, you've just twisted the club face and turned it in towards the basket too much. So work on swinging past the basket, not hitting it, but making sure you keep the club face aiming towards the target as you release through the ball. It's a game-changing golf tip.